அனைவருக்கும் வணக்கம் திஸ் இஸ் சயின்ஸ் வித் சாம் அறிவியல் அறிவோம் நம்ம இன்னைக்கு ஒரு முக்கியமான ஒரு பிரபலத்தை தான் பார்க்க போகிறோம் ஏன் பிரபலம் சொல்கிறேன் அப்படின்னா இவர் ஆராய்ச்சியாளர் விஞ்ஞானி அது கூட சேர்ந்த பிரபலம் இந்த செக் குடியரசு நாட்டிலேயே சென்ற வருடம் முப்பது பேரை முப்பது வயதுக்கு கீழே முப்பது பிரபலங்களை செலக்ட் பண்ணாங்க அதில் ஒரு முக்கியமான பிரபலமாக இருக்கவர் தான் டாக்டர் பீட்டர் ஹவுஸ்விட்ஸ் அவர் லேசரில் ஒரு முக்கியமான ஆராய்ச்சி பண்ணுறாரு அந்த ஆராய்ச்சியில் சென்ற வருடம் ஒரு உலக சாதனை பரி படைத்த ஒரு ஆராய்ச்சியும் பண்ணியிருக்காரு எதற்காக இந்த ஆராய்ச்சி பண்ணுறாரு அப்படின்னா நீங்கள் நிறைய பேர் தாமரை நீங்கள் <laughs> Uh, which you can imagine as cutting and drilling in uh, micrometer dimensions that means million times smaller than one meter and uh, with this uh, high precision we can cut uh, even many different kind of materials uh, here for example you can see some special crystals for scintillators silicon wafers some special alloys glass and we can cut actually many more different materials so why is it that we can reach uh, such high precision with uh, different kind of materials and the answer is of course laser uh, because we are using very uh, special kind of laser device uh, which is not shooting the whole time but it shoots so-called laser pulses uh, and these pulses are in our case uh, extremely short uh, it can be shorter than one billionth of a microsecond and for such short pulses uh, the material can vaporize before the heat can be transferred to the surroundings so that means we can vaporize the material before it melts or before uh, there is any heat uh, accumulation problems uh, so that means except uh, precise cutting and uh, drilling we can actually uh, make uh, functional surfaces Uh, these are examples of functional surfaces which can be found in the nature or this is for example skin of a shark which is antibacterial and drug reduction surfaces so it allows shark to uh, flow with less friction in the water or this is insect eye which has anti-reflection uh, properties and when we have uh, such high precision laser as we do here we can uh, replicate these surfaces and even improve them for example uh, this is a surface on uh, Uh, aluminium alloy and you can see that is very similar to this uh, super, hy- uh, super hydrophobic surface of uh, lotus leaf and by this structure the aluminium is also super hydrophobic and self-cleaning and this is uh, actually a uh, thing I can uh, demonstrate on our uh, samples here so this is the laser marked area which has the lotus leaf like surface and if I use water like this it just bones bounces off and do, do not uh, wet the surface if I use it here you can see that it wets the surface as you are used to but here I can use water like this and it's fine So here you can see another examples from our laboratory. For example, this is uh, the silicon paper which was cut very precisely. Uh, or here there is functional uh, aluminium surface. This is aircraft aluminium alloy and the surface uh, has anti-icing properties. Uh, this is a uh, glass surface which is anti-reflection uh, surface made by laser and as well it has quite high degree of transparency so you can clearly read the text behind the glass uh, so it can be used for example for displays uh, of mobile phones laptops and so on uh, this I already uh, demonstrated and here is uh, 
functional antibacterial structure on a plastic material which was made by injection molded process that means we structured the mold itself and then transferred these uh, structures from mold into plastics directly so we can actually uh, produce quite a lot uh, big amount of these uh, surfaces in a short time without actually using using the laser we can only structure the mold and uh, these samples are also uh, quite interesting because on these we demonstrated that we can uh, significantly improve the efficiency and speed of uh, laser micro nano structuring because thanks to the power which has uh, the laser we used we could split the input beam into more than 40,000 sub beams that means increase the speed in orders of magnitude so basically we are uh, thanks to this technology we are transferring the this scientific discipline into industry environment because we are decreasing the cost and uh, so we are more interested uh, interesting for the industry okay so this is this is the setup which we use uh, for students uh, to train them how to use this laser technology this is uh, the laser head itself and the laser is here it's iterbium fiber laser the output is coming from here there is a telescope uh, just two lenses which can increase the beam diameter and then there are two mirrors which guides the beam inside the scanning head uh, which has two quickly moving uh, mirrors which can displace the beam over the sample uh, and make the shape which we which we want we can program it to make like squares like this or some picture so it is a great tool how to teach students how to operate this laser and processing technology so in a path i will remember pain நிறைய <laughs> laser applications that we have never seen before namma meenum oru swarasyamana vishayathoda namma meenum sandhippom nandri